This is uh, one of my syndicate members and a uh, fishing uh, friend. This is Jez Harris from Priory Fisheries. Um, they supply good quality carp direct from the farm to people like myself, um, known for the quality of fish. Um, he's just showing the, the application of the groats again, good old faithful groats, using the spawn, which is a fairly recent thing. You'll see he's got it clipped up. Um, I don't know if the camera's going to pick it up, but you'll see that lovely cloud in effect. Um, very effective way of delivering quantities of bait. Um, if you're proficient at it like uh, Jez is, um, you'll retain a lot of the juices as well, which is a key component as we keep saying. Um, you'll see he's just loading it there. What are we looking at Jez there, about a quarter litre gone in there? Yeah, probably about a quarter of a litre. Yeah, um, yeah. It's always good sometimes as well to have a bucket of clean water next to you, so as you come in to put in your park in, you can always wash your hands. Yeah, that's a, that's a good just practical tip. That's right, good practical tip, no doubt about it Jez. Because let's so, face it, it's about ease of use at the end of the day, isn't it? This is it, yeah, and good application of bait. Um, it's also recommended as well, before you do cast, just have a quick pull on the line, just to make yeah. sure that we're not got the line going over the eyes. That'll take your tip ring out as soon as look at it, won't it? All right, you'll see as he was talking to us then that there you've got a nice cloud there that was dripping out the bottom of the spot. Um, again, Phil's just illustrated that uh, fishing over several litres, so that would be, what, 20 spodfuls, spawnfuls. So again, if it's applied um, in reasonable quantities, um, it doesn't have to be massive quantities, but if it's applied in reasonable quantities, you can get a very fast response off it. Yeah, thank you, Jez. No problem, you're welcome. So key being the accuracy. Very accurate, isn't it? Just it is. a little bit of practice. Used to, yeah. Once you get used to the weight and the uh, technique of it, it's quite ideal. Um, the good thing is, obviously, as it comes in contact with the water, it opens up. And two things paddle along the side of the top of the wall, which makes so, life a lot easier when you So it's not too it. intrusive when you're intru retrieving. And obviously a lot less disturbance for the fish as well. Yeah, ideal. Well, I have had numerous occasions. As I've been putting bait out with the spod, um, the rods actually screamed off, so the fish are actually coming in and feeding on yeah. the bait. Ringing a dinner bell, as yeah. some would say. Sometimes the fish actually do get attracted to the sound of the spod in the water. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. Nice one, Jess. Thank you very much. Thanks.